What's new for Seismic in 2012? RMS 2012 brings a number of new seismic features to the market, specifically attribute calculations and seismic inversion. These improve accessibility to RMS for geophysicists, in addition to bringing what were considered traditional geophysical tools to the geologist. This will enable you to get as much out of your seismic as possible, helping you build better structural models and facies models. Seismic inversion is a sophisticated process of inverting the seismic data into elastic properties of the reservoir, which helps in the generation of a more precise rock property model. RMS 2012 now has a fast and simple stochastic seismic inversion tool, which can be used as an integrated part of the geomodeling workflow. The automated process is user-friendly, fast and accurate with the implementation of highly efficient geostatistical algorithms. A minimum amount of input data is needed to do inversion in RMS. The dialog is accessed from a grid volume that is used to define the volume you want to invert. The seismic data as AVA stacks with a common offset angle is optimal input for the inversion. Alternatively, AVO data with various reflection angles can be used as it utilizes the fact that the reflection strength from the subsurface interface depends on the material properties where the reflection takes place. Minimal well data is required, with one or more blocked wells containing logs of VP, VS, density and two-way time being enough for the inversion process. The facies log can be used in addition if you want to create facies probability parameters from your inversion. This is unique to RMS. The only other necessary input is a velocity model, which is used for automatic time-to-depth sampling. This small selection of data is used to transform your seismic reflection data into its elastic properties. These can be modelled easily and are particularly useful for data inspection and QC. In addition, acoustic impedance, which can condition your petrophysical models, and facies probability cubes for further use in facies modelling are key outputs of this seismic inversion process. These additional parameters smartly combine the modelling process with the seismic domain in RMS 2012 providing a fast and easy way to analyze the relationship between inversion parameters and facies or 4D pressure and saturation models. Amplitude, phase and frequency are fundamental to the seismic trace and resulting cube. These can be used to derive an array of seismic attributes, therefore extracting maximum value from your seismic. With RMS 2012, you get a solid suite of attributes to help build better models. Originally a tool used exclusively by geophysicists, RMS brings the functionality right into the geologist's domain with a simple and instructive interface providing descriptions and suggested uses for each attribute. Limited input is needed to output the attribute as a realized cube or for a quick overview as slices created on the fly using the preview mode. The cube can be cropped easily to the area of interest for an even faster calculation. The color-coded attributes reveal measurements and changes in measurements, which can be useful for interpreting rock properties, structural features and hydrocarbon accumulations. They can be viewed using the effective array of visual settings which apply to the seismic cubes, such as rendering the color table and setting a transparency, in addition to using probes, which provide a powerful tool for draping an attribute across a horizon or other object. This new functionality means you can get the most out of your seismic data by aiding identification of faults and discontinuities, and providing quick recognition of geological patterns and features. Furthermore, you will be able to better quantify the rock and fluid properties in your reservoir and condition your models to all this new information as attributes are incorporated into the geomodeling workflow. 
Both the new seismic attributes and seismic inversion tools outlined here are major contributors to RMS 2012. They bring seismic straight into the hands of the geologist with their simple and straightforward presentation and descriptive user interface. But this does not restrict their ability to perform the complex calculations required from a geophysical perspective. If you have any questions on what you have seen here, or want more information on other functionality in RMS, please contact us at rms at